Oh, all right, I'm out in the countryside, I'm trying to jog, and uh, I've only run out 10 minutes, but my shins are on fire. I've got shin splints that I've had since I was about 15, 16. So trying to run is like agony. I was hoping that I might have grown out of it, but nah. Just gonna walk a few miles, I think, instead. I think if I try to jog anymore, I'm not gonna walk. <laughs> so I need to uh, keep walking. I'm in the, in the fields, in the middle of nowhere. Well, there's a road next to me, but very soon I'll be in the middle of nowhere. But it's nice to get out of the house, get out from behind the desk, and try and get, uh, well, try and lose half a stone, a stone maybe. Hopefully next month we'll be uh, going on holiday, so I want to try and lose a few pounds before going on holiday. I'm not too fussed about body image, but I do have some, <laughs> just some standards. And I've got, at the moment, I've got what they call the dad bod. If I can lose a few pounds. I did, I did try to go back to the gym, but when they said it's like 32 pound a month, I thought, nah, I think I'll give that a miss this time. Oh, knackered. All right. I think I'll just carry on walking into the next village and uh, see how my legs bear up. All right, I'm still alive. I've gone about three miles now. A bit of a mixture of jogging and walking. Mostly walking, too fair, but <laughs> my poor shins. I feel like I've got knives stuck in both my shins. So it's a bit painful. But all I need is like 30 seconds rest every now and then. And I sort of feel better after that for about five minutes and they flare up again. I'm going to carry on walking for another, I don't know, 20 minutes then sort of head back because I've got a horrible feeling oh my shins might just give up eventually <laughs> I, don't, I don't want to end up in the middle of a middle of a field at the moment I'm on a bridal way or yeah bridal way heading towards Addisham so I'm in between Elsham and Addisham right now so I'm not sure how far I'll get before turning back and this is the bit where I say I'm not lost but I don't know where I am <laughs> Well, I know I am, but I don't know which way I need to go to get home. I can see the road that way. There's cars over that way. I'm pretty sure if I follow this path, I get onto the main road, and then um, it should take me all the way home. As it's getting dark and gloomy. Anyway, right. So that's my walk, day one. Well, not day one. My first day walking, trying to lose a little bit of weight. In my other videos, I said I was up to 16 stones, so I need to drop a little bit, at least by a stone and a half. Well, no, a stone or a half. My normal weight is about 15 and a half stone, um, but I have been down to 15 recently, and 15 was good. But then birthdays came around, Easter came around, <laughs> and all of a sudden I'm 16 stone. The idea is to get down to 15 and a half at least, and if I can push myself down to 15, that'd be a bonus. Less eating in the evening more exercise in the daytime, i.e. go out for a couple of miles walk. I'm also looking to get some dumbbells as well. Get some dumbbells for home. So I'll do a walk, do a home dumbbell workout, and hopefully that should uh, drop me down a stone or so. Hopefully within like six weeks. Seriously, I just think walking, or trying to run, will be just about right, because I don't burn any calories whatsoever at home. And I sit down in my office all day and eat, so whatever I'm eating is just staying on me, I'm not burning anything really. I think the only time I burn calories is at night time when I'm sleeping. Oh, so something else I've got to put in my daily schedule now. So not only do I have to work, do my 100 days vlog video, edit that, and then also fit in a walk. What I'm gonna try and do is um, do my sort of bread and butter work, if you like, during the daytime, and then have a break where this walk will be going handy. This will be quite a nice walk to do and then go back to work after that I think that might help stimulate me to work a bit smarter as well I think trying to work from five in the morning all the way through to about nine ten in the evening is all right but I do get a, a bit of a period where I'm just doing nothing I find myself just staring at nothing so wondering whether just getting out for an hour would actually help so that's what I'm gonna try and do is just use the hour to get out and stretch my legs all right I think that's enough waffle don't forget, check out all my links in my description with all my friends doing the 100 days vlog challenge. That's about it for today. Just me wandering about the countryside, 
in between Elsham and Addisham and uh, you might see a few more of these but hopefully I might have something decent to talk about so just walking in the fields cheerio right just got back from my walk and now I'm gonna weigh myself because I still weigh myself before I left but I've got so I'm gonna weigh myself now and see exactly how much I weigh at the moment Right, that's 15 stone 12, so yeah, a bit of, loot, a bit of weight to lose.